Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. 11 a.m. update and a slightly mixed bag out there. That mix coming from the NDX and the Nasdaq Composite. They're basically flat. They're up three points and one point. Otherwise, we've got the Dow down 40. That's uh, one tenth of a percent. The S&P is flat. The Russell's off uh, about two tenths of a percent or three points. The semi's off one and a half percent. Thirty nine points to the downside there. The trannies are off uh, half a percent. Or 71 buckaroonies. Uh, we've got gold trading out at uh, 1733. That's well off its lows from this morning. It's down three bucks. Silver is off uh, 31 cents, trading at 1797. Light sweet crude up off a buck 11. She's trading out at 9044. Natural gas is up two cents and a 30 year treasury back two ticks. So let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES mini upper left hand corner. What we know, well, what we what we sort of know is, and I'll share share this with you. Yes, it was bar number eight of a TD nine count. Today will become bar number nine, and that's 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 almost a certainty out there. So there should be a bottom inside of the ES mini, uh, really between yesterday and uh, tomorrow. Remember, a lower low can form on the bar following bar number nine. Spot volatility index is trading above its 50-day exponential moving average. As always, dangerous for the S&P 500. The NQ yesterday formed bar number nine. Doesn't show up in this chart. You'll see those when we go do the uh, Trader's Edge show out there. So it's a TD9 count pattern is going to complete today. Of course, you can see the A to B equals CD patterns out there. And therefore, a bullish reversal candle would confirm a Gartley buy pattern. U.S. dollar index just consolidated in between support and resistance of its daily profile. That's really between the 107.69 and 109.20 level. Now, Goldilocks out here, uh, close below a swing point, uh, which would suggest an A to B equals CD to the downside, but price has found support at the bottom of its weekly profile. The bottom of that profile is 1716. The low so far today, 172060. If price were to close below 171660, then we'd see that A to B equals CD that gives us that price projection of 1694. But we know where the buyers are lined up. If we take a look at silver, silver's trading below its swing point from July 14th. That suggests lower price if price continues, if price closes today below $18.17. Lights recruit just consolidating with inside its daily profile. That's between support where the buyers are at at the 86.51 level and resistance where the sellers are located, 94.73. Natural gas, TD9 count top, basically a sideways consolidation. If price did close below 883, we'd be looking to move to 822. And a 30 year treasury just testing the support of the bottom of its daily profile, and that's at 135.30. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show. If, uh, if you're off to start your Wednesday, though, please have a wonderful one. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care now.